All right, today I wanted to show you a, a blade guard modification um, that I made to this. Um, from what I understand, um, due to some new safety standards, this portion of the blade guard was added and um, that interferes when you're trying to double cut uh, with the M6. Um, so I wanted a little easier way to take this on and off. So after talking with Jake and throwing back some ideas, um, this is what I came up with, or this is what we came up with to uh, try to make this a little easier. Um, all you need is a 19 millimeter wrench um, or a socket. I'll probably do a socket and ratchet. Basically, you just have to loosen the two nuts and then the blade guard slides right off. Um, I cut these two slots um, in both sides of the U-bracket that holds the guard on. Uh, was just a hole, um, but we cut these so that they can just slide, um, slide on and off around the bolt. So for the bolts themselves, I used the same bolts that was sent with the mill. The only thing I did was add a jam nut um, to hold the bolt there um, after the guard is removed. And same thing on the other side, just added this jam nut. Um, these are nylon um, insert nuts, so they shouldn't vibrate loose or anything when the guard's not there. So basically you loosen those two nuts um, to do your double cutting um, and then when you're done you can just easily slip the guard back on um, it'll just kind of hang there and then you just take your wrench or ratchet Tighten the guard back up and then you're good to go. Um, I might look into welding these two bolts on at some point, um, but for now I'll just use the jam nut because um, it's working fine. I'll see how it goes. Um, but that's the modification to the blade guard um, that I wanted to show.